Hello and welcome to another episode of XCOM 2 War of the Chosen. Now it has been a while since I've played this. Uh, someone can get promoted. Oh, it's a bad boy. And I believe it's been a while since I last played it, but I believe we are doing a alien base mission. Yeah, we're well, definitely above. I think that's more viable. Because otherwise you just shoot you shoot in your pistol twice. Because the avatar project is quite high now. Commander. The other thing about this one is a Avant Commander will spawn in here. And we can use the uh, Skull Jack to complete the story objective, which will also lower the Avatar project, which is the main reason for this, really. Because we can take this out, we'll go down by one, but then they're going to build one soon. I think it's like within a week, and I'll go up by two. And we need, so we need to get the Skull Jack in to actually make a dent. dent into uh, into the Avatar project. I haven't been recording it in a while, so I might be a bit rusty. <laughs> right. I need a team. I'm not to bring out a strong team. I, I, I'm expecting the Chosen to show up. Who, whose territory is this in, actually? Assassin, right. We need, we need a Templar for sure. We need a Templar for sure. And an effective ranger. So this is, this is basically going to be the A squad with a Templar in it. Because <laughs> we're bringing on uh, the Master Menic, Dr. Feelgood. And give her a flashbang. Which the Chosen are immune to. What does that do? We'll give her the uh, DLC weapon. And her partner is Doom Baktoa, the Skirmisher, so we're bringing him along. He can get close with his grapple to the Chosen. I'm actually going to give him a vest, I think. I think that's more health boost. Will help him. Plus, because he's a faction hero, is more viable. <laughs> They're hard to replace. And standard sh soldiers. I'm going to say shoulders then. I'm like, what the hell are you on about? Shoulders? I meant soldiers. Right. I think that's our best shotgun. We've got three of them. I've not upgraded the sword yet. Is that one. So that does same damage, but has a chance to as an extra aim on it. Uh, do I want to give you the score, Jack? I think because he can get he can use run and gun and all that, he's going to be up front. Really, you want, you want to give it to a medic because they have the hacking, so you get more chance of getting the rewards from it. Especially if it's not story based, you can score Jack anyone. But there's like a chance for feedback on that, so you get damage by using it. Unless it's like a, you have to do it for like a story, so the commander won't, won't have that. There'll be no no penalty for failing. And we'll be on Gain Sprint to bring the boom. I think that's going to be our best uh, our best one. Do we not do we not have anything else available for utility? I thought we did. No, we don't. Can we build anything? The problem is it's been so long since I last played it, I don't know what my plan was now. Yeah. It has to be some sort of armor. We'll give him another advent uh, another another nanoscale vest. Don't gain sweet nine now. I'll never let me hear the end of it. Uh, where's our Templar? Do I even have it? You don't, you don't really have guns, do you? You have a secondary pistol, and that's basically it. And his partner... It's a sniper! That's convenient. 
So everyone's got bonds, so I've got extra turns. Well, not extra turns, but I can give people extra turns. Which will give us more mobility and flexibility, especially if the, if the uh, Chosen shows up, which they likely should. They should anyway. I'll give you the med kit, I guess. So Stonewalker Laminator Dr. Feelgood Doom gains free can heater to check out a alien facility. And also hopefully hire Skulljack, a enemy commander, to get down that avatar project. This is the problem when you, when you have to like, take like, like a week away from playing these things. You had, you had no idea what you were doing. I sort of remember wanting to do the alien facility, but that's basically I don't know what I'm building or Alright, let's do it. Operation Godstorm. The assassin is likely to show it as an alien facility, they typically do. But, as we saw last time we fought the assassin, she isn't that good when you prepare for her. When the party is actually set up to beat her, she gets a shot in and she dies. When the party isn't uh, set up to beat her, she kills you. <laughs> well, she doesn't because she failed in the... Uh, in the um, retaliation mission, but she really should have got someone. I don't know how she didn't. It's because she was going for uh, information rather than kills. We march toward enlightenment. Also, gains three cup. So early on, we're going to want our sniper up on the roof and up to here. Really, this is where the uh, spider armor we can use grappling up will be useful. Not having the uh, hunter's weapon because he only can move and shoot. On the move. Everyone on Overwatch. Oh, hello. And the officer is here. The advent captain nearby. Right. An ideal target for the skull jack. That's good. That's very good. Right, where's our ranger? Because you have to score Jack. Right, you need to get up front because they're probably going to come towards us. It's what this game does. It does like bring them towards you type of thing. As we've seen in that mission where we had view of everything. Right, I could bring my skirmisher up here. But I, I, I don't want to aggro anyone potentially over here. So I want these to come closer. I take out the other two and score out the officer in like one turn type of thing. So I bring you over here. How's that cover? That's barely cover, man. That's not cover at all. You can st look, look. That's not cover. Is that cover? I don't class that as cover. That's a bit weird. No, well, I won't complain. It's full cover. Half cover is pretty. Half cover basically stops you from being critted, and then a full cover stops you from being hit. Is how classic tends to work. Or commander difficulty. That, that's how it tends to work. At least it's like you know consistent. <laughs> he does have lightning hands, so we can get a few shots off with uh, with Mr. Buck here, Mr. Heater. Hey, everyone on Overwatch. I don't. See these getting close enough to spot us. I hope. Okay, they are. Hi, guys. Oh, no. Wow, just. Right, so Levenator can't shoot. Right, we need, we need someone that can kill. Right, we'll go with you first because you can shred some armor here. Get against me! Hello! It's nice, nice to meet you. Where did XCOM? I knew about to die. Right. You finish this guy off. Oh, 
Promotion, oh nice, that was easy. Momentum. Lightning hands. I need to take out his cover ideally. The sniper does have a grenade. So what I can do is lightning hands this guy. He missed, didn't he? God damn it. Yeah, I didn't get it. Good stuff. Catch. And this will take out his cover and his armor. I'll give Dr. Feelgood the shot first. Okay, so I got and then the skull jack. We'll do it from here so we can cover. You know, it's only 70%. I've never had this miss. We have complete access to the advent See, normally this will be like a fail. Oh wow, I almost got it. it is only a matter of time before they detect our now what's going to happen is a codex is going to spawn. And we've got one or two guys. We've got a skirmisher left to deal with it. Oh, I think I'm not going to shoot this turn because he's going to use silent bomb. That appears to be the codex responsible for safeguarding the alien data stores. We'll have to neutralize it if we I can't kill this in one hit. Understood. Weapons hot. We've got our target. How much can I get in a silent? Right. Okay, I want to come over here. I'm just Overwatch. You can just parry. I'm expecting a silent bomb if it gets in range of us. Teleport and sound it bomb most likely. To be yep. a state of flux. He got three, but he didn't get the ranger, which is dimensions. which is fine. They all have to reload now. That's the thing. Right, run and gun. He will be flanked, and I have got dead eye. Eighty-one percent, and this can kill, which is what I want. Because if you hit them, they're gonna split into two. So if he, if I hit him for like. Six damage and he has six health left, he'll split into into two. They'll both have three health left. But if I can kill They're gone. Not too shabby. Excellent work, Commander. It appears some physical remnant of the codex. Right, everyone uh, split up temporarily. It will provide some insight into the aliens on the low, because that does explode after a turn. So we've got the uh, score jack done, so I think that's minus two to progress. Then destroying the facility will give us the third, and there's no chosen either from the looks of it. I'm going. It's a race of a free reload though. Oh yeah. All right. no trespassers. Yeah, everyone just overwatch, this will explode. And then we'll group up again. Now will be a good time for an alien to show up, because then I'm kind of all over the place, but... I'm going. The game's apparently not that harsh. Which I'll take. Ready to rock. I'm assuming I can climb that. Oh yeah, there's a ladder right there, that's handy. <laughs> all right, I'll go. right, get up. I'll dash and hope for the best. I have got aid protocol if I, if I do aggro someone. We're actually approaching from the, from the side of the building. We're approaching from the side and not the front. So... And the other problem is there's no cover until here. Oh, is that okay? So that phantom tree extends, you know, that to here. That's cover, but that isn't. Oh yeah, it is. Okay, that's fine. Right. 
going to move you up because you can't see anything anyway. Good to go. We should have aggro anyone here. I hope not, because then we're all flanked and I'm screwed. Ah, let's cover here. Location confirmed. Get off, Miss. Get off, Miss Feelgood. I'll move the ranger up. I'll move Doom up. That might have been a bad move, that was someone there. It's just a turret. It can shoot more than once, basically. Right, we will have squad sat on that. I think we can also use a uh, whiplash, and that can that will just it'll do double damage, so it, it will kill. It's a free attack, and if there's another robot in there. That's going to be more useful because the turret's not that big of a threat. Okay, this will kill because six damage up to four. No, oh, it's got four armor. Um, I didn't realize I thought it had two. Dan. I need max damage, Dan. We got minimum. Dan. Four, four armor, that's insane. That's insane, man. Can Game Street not get a view of the turret? Yeah, I mess up. I, mean, I I have messed up a bit here. Or I can just try and stun it and get everyone up. Everyone up for next turn. I misread it. I thought it had two armor, not four. Uh, we'll stun. Try and stun it. Yes. Don't want to take control either way because it's a low chance or well, lowish chance. Forty-two percent isn't terrible. Uh, but then if we, it might aggro everyone up here. It might be a, a party up here for all we know, like a pod. Then you need to get here. On the move. And don't aggro anyone. By hand. I will sense oh. Any oh, hello. Two sectoids. It's a good job we shot that turret down if we can take it out. So we can focus on, on these this, this turn. Get him! As he dives into the ground. Like headbutts the ground. Interesting. That did annoy him though. Right. We'll take out the uh, sectoids here for these melee attacks. There is another turret. But we can parry with the uh, Stormwalker here. Alternatively... Actually, we can't actually see it from here. We're like one tile short. Right. Where's our Ranger? Right, is that cover? That's cover. Right, that'll do. We're flying because of this guy, so I'm hoping we take him out. <laughs> the main thing is, they've got no mind control. Well, how about that? Uh, right. Who's got the best shot here? Right, you've got lightning hands. Dodge Graze, I hate dodge. But it is a 3-2 damage, and this guy is quite hard to hurt. So any damage I'll take, hopefully this hits. It does, it's for, it's for full damage. I don't know if that was like max damage as well, but he didn't dodge it. He didn't dodge it. Alright, we've got combat protocol. So that's guaranteed to hit. Is it guaranteed to kill this guy? It's not. Right. 
Go for the kill. Nice, 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 nice. Zero in in. Let's take out this turret as well then, if we can. If we can. And the heavy turret is there. Oh, now we can see it. Right, we'll throw a grenade over Stormwalker's cover. I know that turret. If it takes out the floor, it'll insta kill it. And it did. <laughs> bye bye turret. Nice knowing you. You know, parry in case anyone appears. And you you come up, get with the t get with the team. Right. I don't want to go there because I think that's going to activate someone, and I, don't, I can't really shoot. We're coming from this way through the hole we've created. I think that's a safer route here. Get the melee guys up front. Not a problem. We need our sniper now, we're really up here. And then again, he's not gonna have much to shoot from. We need, we need him like here then. Just gonna get, get some sort get some sort of coverage. Location confirmed. We don't get the high ground, so we can't use that death from above if he has it. I think he does actually. Okay, take a chill pill, man. A confident approach. He needs to reload, actually. Everyone needs to reload the next uh, next turn. I've got a lot of like teamworks as well, so I can give turns to other people if these get too far ahead or something. That, the, uh, the front team. Right, reload. Must reload now. I will watch. You don't need to reload. You don't need to reload. You've got a free reload, so you don't need to do that. Oh, just a skirmisher that needed to reload. I'm assuming they're inside the building. See, if I... I'm extracting, so if they're not here, I can just plant the bomb and leave. Which would be great. No Aww. Who knows how long they've been keeping these storage units running down here. That would have been great, but well, also been very convenient. Unless it's XCOM. Oh wow, they're coming out the door. Okay. Right then. Right, he's over there. Do you have a, do, does a sniper? He has one at 21%. Right. I think that means you need to come up and use a grenade. Let's take out this prick's cover. Of course, this is the only thing my sniper's got a shot at, so I need to take this guy out with the sniper. Because otherwise, he's useless this turn. Take out his cover. And then my sniper should have a much better shot at this guy. He was still in cover. But he can kill. He needs max damage. He needs to hit first. That's terrible. Right, combat protocol. Did they have a mech? Heavy Lancer, Spectre. Right, okay. That Spectre does need to die because he can shadow rend. Seven to eight. Well, I'm not to take it. <sighs> I only struck their armor. Right, he's likely to like move and then use his shield thing. 
So I don't think he's a big threat this turn. This is a Lancer. Can I get can I get anyone on this Lancer? Right, if I use grapple. If I grapple onto there and jump down. Then how many I think I'm, I'm gonna play the option I think is gonna work and just jump up here to skip like the five tiles. That might give me enough to flank this guy, which it does. I have got teamworks available, so I can like if someone can get a shot. Right. So first of all, this is free damage. So if this hits and then we shoot, we can kill. Actually, that also misses. Ninety-one percent for a guaranteed six damage. Sixty-seven with a forty percent chance to crit. One, there's one half left. Who's left? I think someone's getting shadow mended here, which isn't great. But we can kill the spectre, and then it'll be fine. Cause it'll be the, that and like a single health point shield bearer. Nearly got us available. You. Right, okay. Moving to fire position. Seems doable. Set this guy out. Did you see that one? And then you're gonna use combat protocol to set this guy out. And we'll get the loop. Get the hair trigger, that's not, that's not too bad. I have what we needed. Then I'm going to use parry and help. If he goes for Stormwalker, the parry will stop the shield bearer. Will stop the shallow rend. And he's going for the uh, ranger. I didn't want that, but I think the ranger was closer. It doesn't do any damage though, so it should be fine. But it does give it knocks one of my guys out and gives them a uh, another another unit. Where's he going? Away. That's not too far away. We can flank that guy. Well, first things first, we're obviously gonna shallow run this brick. Because I think I can flank and kill, I don't need to use a grenade or anything here. Yeah? Momentum. Can use justice here. Pull him out of cover. Hey, dude. Please die. Then we'll just casually blast him in the face. I'll get rid of the shadow end as well. Then our guys back up like nothing happened. And you can come here and plant the bomb. So it is going to be a, a, a flaw, some looks of it. I've jigged it on a great. <laughs> right, evac. Move to the extraction point for immediate evac. Can be here. I'm not going to evac until everyone's in. Because reinfor reinforcements are going to show now. You can use that reinforcements to get like promotions, really. Absolutely. If you wanted to, you can just keep, you, you can just keep killing them because they don't stop. I don't think they'll stop anyway. I never stayed long enough to find out. Right. Sniper. I right, get up. Got it. Moving. You just parry in case anyone shows up. Is that everyone done? Well you overwatch. 
at the end of the turn. There's still aliens on the field. But we don't need to kill them. And we don't get any uh, stuff on them anyway, because we don't extract with their bodies. Okay, you can get here. Which is good, because the odds are there's going to be like a flamethrower guy. <laughs> that spawns in. Well, let's get out of here. Let's go, let's go, let's go. I'm out of here. That was a good mission, that. All things considered. That was our A team, and no one's severely injured or anything. They'll be a bit tired, but that'll be fine. Because there is a chance that like, a gorilla up will appear like, right after I come back. Because this is like a mission that I've had to activate, and it's not spawned in type of thing. Let's go. Ready to boogie. Menace one five status confirmed. X four charges detonating. Rip. Press F to pay, to pay respects. There were two enemies left. I don't care who they were. Right. Kaboom bomb, what? Kaboom boom. We'll stick that one in orange like an explosion. Oh, that's a cute pose. I would like to assure the city. So good stuff. And I think it will also enable us to build the shadow chamber, which I do want. Because it tells you what enemies you're going to face, and it's great. Three promotions. The Templar's tired, so hopefully the assassin doesn't show. <laughs> See, the Temple has some really good abilities. It really does. But I'm going to go with Overcharge. And I'm going to go with Pellet as well. Because he had the extra AP. Laminator gets promoted to Captain. And you will get a... Uh, Playstorm, because in Placeable, you get a single bonus move, but you can't shoot. You can just move away. It's like um, momentum for uh, the Templars. Free widget? Once again, this guy's got some good ones. And you can make it so Overwatch gives him any action, you can move away or anything. But I will get combat presence. Uh, hmm, I'm going to take that as well. Because if he's up front, I can use that to bait like an attack. That might not hit him. And he gets extra. You can, can shoot that three or four times in, in a turn. With uh, zero in, in as well. So if you get shot at, you can like, shoot three times, I think. Commander, please thank our troops for completing what was surely a difficult task in acquiring the Codex brain. So killing the Codex reduces the avatar progress by one. The and then by two. An step the total of I think that's for destroying this facility, and that's for the uh, Codex. New objective added. I'll, I'll research that once plasma rifles are done. We'll have to find a means of breaking the code. But I expect it will take some time. Impressive work. One. 
And then another two. Oh, Codex it does reduce by one, then Facility takes it by two. Oh, I'll let it run. We do have the black site. So that'll also reduce it if we want to want to do it. And we're going to scan for this DLC mission now, because this gives us mechs, and mechs are good. And we get some extra supplies as well, that'd be nice. And Mol Diaz has been promoted. Right. I can hunt the assassin again. What I will do is I will actually use Cashman and uh, Li Mei Zeng. Hi, Jack. And then when she comes back, I'll I'll train her. I'll get rid of a a fear of the chosen. That's funny. I'm sending someone who is afraid of the chosen to hunt the chosen. I'm very good. I'm a smart commander. She must defeat her fears. Low chance of an ambush, which will likely happen to be fair. Wounded, I don't care about because I've got I've got I've got a decent team now. My followers will lead this action to victory. And skull mining is done. And I will start building a spider suit because I want that for my snipers. Me Charlie. Oh great. Don't attack my scientists, that's that's mean. The game does not does not want me to get plasma rifles. Right then, now this will be the next mission. We're still picking up power readings, but no signs of light. Still, we know that transmission came from this location. I'm betting I, I forgot an engineer here. Commander, if we're sending in a squad, I'd like permission to go along. Whoever sent that message, they know as much about my father's systems as I do, and I want to find out why. I've only, I've only, I've only, got, I've only got one. I've only got one. I need a second. I got another sniper. Great. Right. Who do I have in the recruitment pool now? Anthony Livingston, and I have got Bradley Robinson, the Doctor Bradley. We'll go. Right, we'll go from the top. What's what's her will? Now, their quest for vengeance serves our purpose. Is, it, is it always a start of does it always start for or does that change? I don't know, but we'll train her now anyway. I'm sure I'm sure it varies a little bit. So I want a second uh, a second site operative. So one can train, one can be uh, in the field. I don't need you there right now, because no one's injured. So I'll stick you in the uh, excavation for now. Just, just knock it down to seven days. But next time we would have win the DLC mission to get mechs. Mechs are quite OP when that late level, because they can have three attacks and can just shred armor to pieces if they can actually hit. The aim is quite low. But that's for next time. Thank you very much for watching, and I will see you next time on so Let's Play XCOM 2 War of the Chosen. Mm -hmm.